social media and on television today. It is simply called the human dog bed. This is Pluffle, the ultra comfy machine washable human dog bed. Let that sink in. It's exactly what it says it is. This is a dog bed, but it is human size. We have the inventors here. They are the creators of the very first Evel human dog bed. I'm so proud to introduce you to Noah and Yuki. Together, they are friends, they are roommates, they're business partners. They came up with this idea for a human dog bed. We're gonna tell you the story, but I will tell you this very quickly. Already very popular, brand new today here at HSN. We have it on flexible payments. We have it on free shipping. We have two colors, the gray or the blush. Now, uh, if you do want the blush, there's like a hundred of those remaining. You guys don't know this about me, but I actually have had many dogs, oh, wow. many rescue dogs. Okay. And I've bought so many dog beds <laughs> over the years. I know a thing or two about dog beds. And they're usually not this nice. <laughs> no, no. We really wanted to upgrade from the normal dog bed to something that feels comfortable, supportive, and really cozy enough for a person and not just what you would get yeah. at your average store. So how did you guys come up with the idea? Because I'm just already feeling like I just need to lie down for a minute. Yeah, well, while you, while you take ah. a nap, I'll, I'll tell you the story. So it's pretty <laughs> funny, actually. Back in university, I actually uh, took care of an elderly Great Dane. And as you probably know, and all of you know, Great Danes are huge, and so are their dog beds. And this dog was so massive that we actually needed a custom homemade bed for it. And during college, when I was stressed or exhausted, I would go to this dog and we would, I would do work in its bed, we would cuddle, <laughs> take naps, as you do. But because it was homemade, it really wasn't that comfortable. And so I always kind of longed for something that was better and more cozy and more optimal. And so that is kind of what really sparked this crazy idea for the, the world's first dog bed for humans, the Pluffle, as we have here today. <laughs> the original. Yeah, and flash forward, you know, we've delivered this product to thousands of customers all across the country, got on Shark Tank, and we're just so excited to be showing this to you all today on HSN. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. By the way, these guys have uh, already been very, very popular on social media. They were featured on Shark Tank. Here's what you need to know at HSN. We have the best price anywhere. We have the best price anywhere, and they are going so fast they could sell out in this airing. They could sell out very, very quickly. A fun gift idea. This is the gift for the person who has everything or for the person that has kids, that has teenagers, or wants their own little cuddle spot, hangout spot, a place to relax and chill. I mean, they're just so fun, <laughs> but they're so beautifully made too. Yeah, so I want to talk a little bit more about the product. So, no offense to Sarah, but it's more than just your average dog bed. Yeah. They really wanted to create a uh, really unique, ultra comfortable relaxation experience. And how we did this was, first of all, you can already see Sarah, she's rubbing that fur. It's really, really soft. It's silky, it's, it's the softest thing you'll probably ever have touched. And that's because we spent a lot of time finding the perfect fabric for it. Not too long, not too short. Uh, so you can kind of relax and, and after a long day, just, just feel good. Another special thing about this bed is its foam. I think Sarah was touching on it earlier, but it's a mattress grade orthopedic memory foam. So you won't feel the ground, right? And it has no. a waterproof cover on it. So that means that it's accident proof. Also the cover, it's machine washable. So that means you can take it right off, you know, and throw in the wash and it's good to go. So we have a funny story. We just adopted <laughs> a little puppy, a rescue puppy, okay. two months ago. And the first thing it did was jump in the pluffle and had a little bit of an accident. But luckily the pluffle, it's machine washable. So we took the cover right off, put it in the wash. And when we took it out, it was soft as when we first got it. So we really, that's, you know, exactly why we made it machine washable and as soft as it is exactly for those kind of moments. Yeah, that's the number one feature I look for in a dog bed. After all the rescues, all the fosters, I think we've had more than two dozen dogs <laughs> stay with us, live with us, not oh, to wow. mention we're always dog, <laughs> we're always dog sitting. We're, we're like that couple you call when you need, when you need to find a place for the dog for the weekend. We're, we're, we're those people. Uh, and if it's not a removable washable cover, nope, it's, it's not even, you know, in consideration. Also, I have replaced so many dog beds because the foam breaks down over time. I can tell you right now, I can't even feel the floor, right? This is memory foam. 
That's right, so it's an orthopedic mattress grade memory foam. So it's got two layers. I can flip it up just to kind of show you guys what's going on in here. So we really spent a lot of time finding the perfect piece of foam for it. And when you open it right up, you can see that blue layer right there, that's the memory foam. And the bottom, that's the orthopedic foam right there. This comes right out. Um, and this is a waterproof cover. So as I mentioned, when our puppy had a little accident, it didn't seep through to the foam, which meant that only the thing we had to wash was a cover and the foam was good to go. So yeah, that's really, that was really important to us when we first made this product. And well, yeah, because if you're feeling the floor, right, what's the point? Uh, but lying down, I don't feel the floor. I don't feel my hip or my shoulder or my elbow digging right in. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything like this? Is this not the coolest idea ever? So tell me how, how people are using the human dog bed and, and what ages. I mean, I'm sure you guys are just basically college kids, yeah. right, recently, so. <laughs> so, I mean, we're college kids. We kind of designed this out of our personal yeah. need for a product like this. But we found this to be such a huge hit with anyone that's just looking to relax after a long day. You know, we see parents yeah. are buying it for their kids as Christmas gifts and holiday gifts, grandparents for their grandchildren. Dads are using it in the rec room while they're watching the sports game. Moms are relaxing after like a long day at work. It really is just proving to be an item that everyone is enjoying and everyone is loving, especially during the holidays. You know, this is perfect as the weather gets a little bit colder. It's the, the perfect time to snuggle up with your pet, with your kids, with yourself. Um, it really is a truly versatile yeah. and amazing home comfort <laughs> item. <laughs> well, I was just thinking, uh, I've got nieces and nephews, and, you know, they love gaming. They love watching movies. My nieces and nephews, they, they would love this, right? And, like, kids, they, they love anything that's stuffed animals. They love anything that makes them feel cozy. They love anything that makes them feel secure. But I also know grown men and women that would love to have this in your home. Maybe you don't have, you know, four couches in your living room. Someone could always be hanging out in the d human dog bed, watching TV, watching movies. You could read a book. I mean, would this not be amazing? You could take a nap <laughs> in front of your fireplace. You know, I'll tell you, in our apartment, we have yeah. a full couch and chairs, but whenever anyone comes over, they just want to hang out yeah. in the fluffle. And our, yeah. I mean, we have so many of them, <laughs> as you can probably imagine. And our couch, our chairs, the stuff we spent a lot of money on is always completely empty, and everyone's just hanging out in the pluffles. <laughs> We're all in the pluffles. Uh, in fact, our, our crew's already like, they're like, wait a minute, here's Sierra. Uh, she's getting comfortable. She's like, it's, uh, it's late Sierra, at night. Sierra, meet Noah, meet <laughs> Yuki, the creators, the inventors, the designers. But this would be so awesome in any apartment, in any dorm. Mm -hmm. And I love the idea that you can take it with you too, right? Yeah, yeah. I'll just kind of demonstrate right now. But this product folds in half. Uh, so this is great if you're going camping, if you're bringing it to your kids' room, moving places. You know, a lot of people are worried this is bulky. Mm -hmm. It also comes vacuum sealed. So it's really great as a Christmas holiday gift. It comes in a small, much smaller box. So, you know, I think, I think if you get this for your family, you're going to be the favorite. Uh, so it is really the holiday gift. We were actually just uh, on Google's top 100 trending holiday gifts. Uh, the awesome. human dog bed, the pluffle human dog and made it. Uh, so we're really excited about, about uh, getting this into uh, people's homes this holiday season. And HSN <laughs> wants you to get it at the lowest price anywhere. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's also really important because you can get it on the pluffle website. It's what, $4.99? Usually it's $4.99. Yeah, yeah. $4.99. It's $2.79 here at HSN. Mm -hmm. Two seventy nine, mm -hmm. and then we have flexible payments and free shipping. Uh, what was the regular shipping and handling on that? Yeah, like nineteen dollars. It, it's not easy to ship something this large. So get it home for about fifty five dollars. You will have the best gift. You'll have something that you can take instant Instagram, TikTok videos. You, how many people can fit? Let, let's the three of us. If we all wanted we to sit all in this dog I think we can all. Can we do it? There we go. Pretend we're watching a movie. <laughs> we're a family right here. Yeah, there we go. This is awesome. What should we watch? It's, Playing video games. It's kind of like instantly ergonomically designed, right? Whether you want your feet out, whether oh, you want a little yeah. backrest. It's supposed to be super versatile. So if you're napping, leaning back and reading mm -hmm. a book, just hanging out, watching a movie, it's supposed to be very multifunctional and super multi-purpose. <laughs> Okay, how many how many times has someone like had to crash at your place and you're like, 
I don't have a spare bedroom, but what I do have is the human dog bed. Every time someone sleeps <laughs> over, they're staying do they in the want puffle. To, do they want to sleep in yeah, it? Yeah, they do. Well, like I mentioned, awesome. we have a pull-out couch, and people choose to sleep in the puffle. My parents <laughs> actually just visited me two weeks ago, and I offered to get them a room. They're like, no, my mom was like, I want to sleep in the puffle. She insisted she sleeps in the puffle, and she yes. had a great time Did all three she? nights she was here. Yeah, so. uh, I just, you know, it's, it's okay to wish you were a dog for a day. I mean, how many times have you looked at your pet and like, gosh, it'd be nice. They just they just get to cuddle. They just get to sleep in their little dog bed. And, oh, totally. You know, get out and enjoy the day. <laughs> this kind of just brings us back to what we love to do. We love to be with family and friends. We love to get together. It could be game night. It could be sleepovers, you know, with your kids. It could be teenagers that end up crashing at your place. You could take it camping. You could take it, if you've got like a ski condo and you just need one more bed. Yeah, perfect for, your, for your cabin, all yeah. of that. Exactly. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, we have a weekend cabin, and that would just be so much fun. Or, you know, even if you're just heading off to your little weekend getaway, you could bring the human dog bed. But we do have the two collars, and by far, very, very popular out of the gate, I think it was, was the gray. And then if you do want the blush, we have 90 left. I could see this. Uh, my, my niece is a teenager, <laughs> but, you know, she could actually not only enjoy this in her like little girl's room, but she could like take this to college and this would be the perfect like yeah. fun accent for a dorm room when you just want to pull out something and, and do some reading, do a little homework, just relax. Well, They're so inviting. Well, funny story I tell you actually is we had one customer order 12 of these for a 12 year old girl's birthday sleepover. Wow. And so the whole room was just filled with these bright <laughs> pink, <laughs> Pluffles and everyone had their own and it was I think they that girl probably won the award for best sleepover birthday of the year Look how far. big they are <laughs> now if you if you have a big dog They're gonna love it, but how many times have you wanted to get in your dog bed with your dog? Now you could get the whole the whole, you know animal family in here. You got two dogs and a cat uh, there, There's still room and there's room for you and your partner, your spouse, the kids. You could do like bedtime stories in here. It would be so much fun. You look ready to, to pass out. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is past my bedtime. I'll be honest with you guys. Same for us. <laughs> <laughs> well, I love how plush they are. And again, I love that you put in a lot of quality into this as well, because I think that's also important uh, that you get all the memory foam and you get all this durability, a removable washable cover. I also love the fact that that inside cover is waterproof. That's got to be big. And That's it, huge, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and some feature I want to touch upon is this pocket right here. Mm -hmm. uh, you can put your game, video, favorite video game consoles or your remote controls. Everyone knows that couch eats your remote control, but that's why you created the pocket, so you never will lose your remote. Uh, but your favorite book, mm -hmm. your Kindle, whatever it is, we created this pocket so you can store anything. Um, some people like putting their snacks inside. So oh, yeah. you know, there's a lot of use cases that for idea. that pocket. Yeah. All right, let's see how many people can get in the, the human dog bed. I don't know how many of our crew <laughs> want to come on out. I'll slide over. I'll make room. Who wants to join me? We've got Sierra. In. We've got Tracy. We've got oh, the guys. Oh, we've got, yeah. yeah. Come on, let's try it, let's try it. We're all scoochie, one big family. We're, we're starting we a new one. This is, all, look, we got four. Uh, four big adults. Four big adults. Now, now Sierra's taking advantage. She's, She's like, wait, wait a like, minute. I can, I can totally relax, I can hang out. But you know, every Christmas there's that one gift, the one gift that goes viral. Yeah. There's that one mm -hmm. gift that like everyone starts talking about and then you can't wait to share. You can't wait for people to open this or, I mean, you would, be, it'd be a little challenging to wrap this. <laughs> Would you just put it under the tree? Yeah, well, like Yuki mentioned, the, it does come vacuum sealed, so the box is not, not quite as large as you would imagine. It's super easy mm -hmm. to store before the holidays and wrap up and won't actually take up too much space in your home or under your tree. The box actually has a built-in handle, so you can yeah. carry it around before you have to open it up. So yeah, it, I think it's nice. really going to be a great under the tree holiday Christmas shocker and, and a delight. I think you're going to find the perfect nap spot. You're going to find the perfect place to chill. Whenever you just need to get away from it all, <laughs> there is there is a place for you. It's called the human dog bed. <laughs> Honestly, guys, this is a brilliant idea. I wish I thought of it. Uh, Sierra just might stay here until her shift tomorrow. <laughs> Does anyone else want to crash at the HSN studios tonight? Uh, but we'll, we'll run this really great video one more time that kind of